and with the self club, is there like, do you have separate things? Because obviously the self is made up of so much. <laughs> do you have like separate things you look at? And, you know, is it just for women or women and men? Do you want to like dive into what it's kind of all about? Yeah, totally. So, oh, yeah, it's like the self is such a huge thing. You know, and yeah. I think one of the places that I, I one of my biggest passions is like self-discovery. Yeah. And this this is kind of what I was saying before, like rather than living a life, right, based on these like ridiculous expectations, whether it's like our parents or the movies we saw or our grandparents or whatever, right? Mm-hmm. It's like that basic self-discovery, like why didn't anybody ask us what we love, what our values are, what makes us really happy and fills our soul up? So that's a lot of the basic work, right? It's like that reconnecting with you and that's yeah. like, hey, what are your strengths? What are your skills? And this is developing not only your internal self-awareness, but also external. So mm-hmm. it's how do other people perceive you? And are you aware of how you are perceived, right? Yeah. So that's the external self-awareness. So that's a lot of the big chunk um, of it is that self-awareness piece. And it's it's for, I mean, it's not for men or women, it's for both. But now after like doing so many workshops and like trainings and stuff, I've now like focused on the feminine. Mm-hmm. and we we touched on like this feminine energy but also just like women's self-confidence because I never wanted to like maybe because of this masculine energy that I have as well right where I kind of feel like I want to compete with men I don't know right like I don't want to go down just like the feminine groups and isolate no and so but I did all this reading <sighs> I've been doing so much research on like female self-confidence and it's not it's just not balanced, you know, like the, yeah. the, the amount of like women's self-worth, mm. their perception anyway, not their self-worth, their perception of their self-worth is so much lower on average than men's. 